My friends, somehow the news for the Marvels continues to get even worse. It's honestly impressive at this point how much of a disaster this movie is turning out to be. And now we are seeing the numbers rolling in for the second weekend in the box office for this film. And holy moly, it is just honestly, it's just laughable, my friends. It is laughable. So we're going to get into all of this and see what is going on. The Marvel suffers massive drop in the second weekend at the box office. Massive should be capitalized. It should be all in caps because holy smokes this is a complete and total train wreck the marvels plummets up to 80 percent in the box office nightmare superhero movies often fall more than 50 percent in their second weekends they're front loaded with enthusiastic fans and that initial box office return is so mighty it's impossible to match but this time around the fans are not that enthusiastic as we continue to see happen often these days with marvel and then there's the marvels it's no secret the film under well in its opening frame, earning just $46 million. That's a third of what the original film opened with and the worst MCU debut ever. And it just got worse. Don't forget this film costs upwards of $300 million to make. Like that in itself shows how much money this film is going to lose. The Marvels is on pace to drop 75 to 80 percent in its second box office mission was just 10 million this <laughs> weekend i am glad to see that diversity and pursuing things like the mcu agenda is working out really well in their favor the marvels had a significant drop at the box office the week this weekend after a slow start but the marvels only pulled in about 2.8 million on friday <laughs> Two point eight million <laughs> guys. Guys, this is a complete joke. This is pathetic, man. There's no other way to say it. It's just pathetic. And the most hilarious thing about all of this is how much reaching continues to happen from the woke media, from those who continue to try to defend this film as some sort of success. And even if and it's very hard for them to paint it in any sort of successful way, but we are even seeing just people coming up with absolutely insane excuses like this. There are, of course, a number of factors at play here, not least the fact that it came out in the midst of the SAG after strike. Hikes. Ah, yes. That's the reason why the Marvels did not perform well, guys. It's because it came out in the midst of the SAG strikes. It has nothing to do with the intersectional nonsense. It has nothing to do with all the woke BS. None of that. I don't know about you guys, but it's really starting to reek like BS in here. The Marvels is showing that there has to be a change. There has to be a course correction. But will they course correct? Well... I, for one, wouldn't bet money on it. So with that being said, let me know what you think about all of this in the comments below. Leave a like, subscribe, and I'll talk to you all in another video very soon.